Now, when we talk of malex, malex, it is a hatchery bony disease. Hmm? It's okay. Malex, it is a hatchery bony disease. The signs and the symptoms, the first one we hear is losing weight. Egwa nyama. It has no chemical medicine for treating malex. The incubation period is three months. Malex appears at three months. How? They start by losing appetite, losing weight, getting paralyzed and it dies. It is a combination of all these diseases. As you see HIV AIDS, this is Malix here. But we are very lucky, me as Yisa, I discovered from my research, this is the medicine which I use to vaccinate and treat if it happens that you are not very sure that your chicks were not vaccinated against Malex, please start it now. And they should be less than one month. Malex can be treated or can be vaccinated or prevented before or in the period of 30 days. We have that medicine, and I'm proud of it. Malexi is vaccinated at day one when you are using the chemical medicine or the chemical vaccine. Now, there is one thing I want you to understand. Because some people there fail. This is now the, the vial. Please. If you are going to vaccinate your birds, this goes even to the veterinary officers there. This is the way you handle the medicine. Once you handle it in this format here, and you start sucking, it takes only three seconds when this medicine is damaged. Line dagala di nobu likwata mochibatu bot. Bot. Second, this is Satungali for day. Don't waste your energy, don't waste your time and disturb the chicks that you are vaccinating them. This vaccine is already damaged because you handle it directly in this format. There is a reason why they put this rubber here. Once you remove this rubber here, you handle in this format. Then you inject the syringe. And once you inject that syringe, please, we are here to learn. I don't want you to be left behind. Because some people, they are just there enjoying, not learning. What I need is you to understand. Now, this syringe here, it is for livestock, because I'm here to, to share what you need to know. In that, I'm interested in sharing every knowledge you, need, you desire to know, because there are some people there who are benefiting. Now, if you handle your vial like this, then inject in, in this format here. After that, make sure that where you are going to mix it from, again, you don't handle it like this. Still, it should be handled in this format. Then inject in, in this format here. But some people you do it, you, you inject in this format. 
this is very wrong. You start injecting the medicine or the vaccine in the motor you the, 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 the in the bottle. You are mixing when it has that temperature of the hand of the body. It is very wrong. And if at all already you have mixed the medicine or the vaccine and you handle it like this and you start sucking, this is already wrong. It is done in this format here. But once you handle it like this, please don't waste your time. What you will be doing will be vague. Two, malexi has no chemical treatment. I need it to be very clear. Malexi talina dagala zunguli mugjanjaba. It is vaccinated at day one for the chemical vaccine. But for the herbal medicine, even at 30 days, it can be used to cure that or to prevent or to vaccinate. Lino, it covers in vaccination schedule. And it covers in a treatment. It does not require to be put in the fridge. No. It is the way you use it. Habo. Because you see, Ugandans, at times we take time to understand. But there is that habit of perfectionism whereby you say, I will do with the time. At times you fail to fulfill what you had wanted. And if it is a treatment for Malik, it is one meal in the mouth. If it is one month. But if it is less than one month. It is just four drops in the mouth. I'm talking of the vaccination or treatment against Malex disease. I need it to be very clear. Because here we are not passing time. Neither wasting your data. What we need is to see that what you require to know and learn is what we present it to you. Malex is done. Malex has no chemical medicine for treatment. But we have it here. Remedies. Then, intubation period. You to know or to learn or to, disap to discover that my chicks have malex, it is done at three months. So that is the way how malex is treated or vaccinated. That's number one. As I said it before, malex disease, it is a hatchery bony disease. It is a combination of all these. As I told you before, HIV, it was a combination of various viruses. TB, measles, VD, something like that. Malaria. When all those ones were co combined, they came up with HIV AIDS. And even here, Malex here, now Motebi may come with the AIDS when they have Newcastle. Hajat brings the AIDS when they have four pox. Abdu brings the AIDS when they have Fraser. 
Then Ibra brings the eggs when they have typhoid. And once these ones all combine, will run to Malix. Has no chemical treatment. I have to be very clear about that. And don't start, because there are some veterinary officers there who were not to be veterinary officers. These, they were supposed to be agriculture extension officers. Who may come, ah, ah, we have the medicine for Malix. To be honest, there is no chemical medicine for Malix. As there is no chemical medicine for swine fever. We need to be very clear about that. There is no chemical medicine for Newcastle. So please, that's how Marex is controlled. The second disease, it is Newcastle. Newcastle, it can happen at any stage. The signs and the symptoms, the major one is the green diarrhea. The second, getting paralyzed. The third, shaking and shivering, loss of appetite. Finally, the massive death. It is still vaccinated. You can vaccinate using the chemical vaccines. But in universal farm care or living agriculture, we vaccinate using remedies. Oh, habo. And it works effectively. Intubation period, it is just hours. And they start dying. Then, Gomboro, how do you discover that your chicks have developed Gomboro in them? One, huddling together. You find them in one corner, shedding of feathers, the chocolate diarrhea, oyananuka, intubation period, hours. Chemical medicine, no. These ones here have no chemical medicine. Tomara would be. But for the herb we have. Now, treatment. This goes to the Gomboro people. The first aid for Gomboro outbreak. Get a quarter, a kilogram of sugar plus 60 tablespoon of salt mixing 20 liters of water give them it will take 10 to 30 minutes when they have recovered when bagambi and living agriculture here we share and give you what you need to know be not any no one because they don't know it the first aid and the first treatment for Gomboro, get a quarter kilogram of sugar, get six tablespoons of salt, mix or dissolve in 20 liters of water. Give them. In a period of 20 to 30 minutes, they will recover there and then. Then you start using ours here. Never use any chemical medicine like antibiotic to be giving the Gomboro disease. They are going to die there and then instantly and start complaining. This is the first treatment for Gomboro. Intubation period, just hours. Treatment, it is that one. Then follow pox, swelling of the eyes, having wounds, the yellowish dropping, once you get this, it is vaccinated. During the chemical medicine, you can vaccinate that. And the vaccination program at six weeks. 
fallopox is vaccinated at six weeks if you are to be using the chemical vaccine. But if we were to be using ours, it is just four drops in the eyes or in the nostrils. This is fallopox. But if we were to be treating them using the chemical medicine, use gentamicin, 5%, injectable. Gobobori nako is a dagara zoom. Use gentamicin, 5% injectable. Mixed up with multivitamin. But we inject here. Nowhere else. It is done once. But if it persists, put them in the rubbish spit. No solution. Now for hours, using this ones here, it is just four drops in the nostrils here and in the eyes. And make sure you dip the cotton wool or sponge in this medicine here and pass where the wounds are. Only once, no more treatment. I told you before, the reason why we give you this, it is because you liked us. The reason why I come here and shout, I'm doing on behalf of the Almighty. That's the reason why I didn't go in 2023. Because I have some role I have to play. Such that whoever he wants to go into poultry, piggery, rabbits, livestock, can acquire knowledge from living agriculture. So this is how we need to do this. If you feel you have some little money you can send, or you want them be, or come pay the zayo mutual, or but you are going to go to Kayo. Many of them are not going to go. At any stage, you have to be That's no sense. Ah, uh -uh. we are doing. This work of voluntarily, such that everyone on air can acquire and access our knowledge at no cost. So please, this is how fallopox is treated. Just four drops in the nostrils or eyes. If not that, dip the cotton or the sponge in the medicine and Put where the wounds are only once. You don't need it for the second time. The rest you keep. Full typhoid. The sign and the symptom of full typhoid is shedding feathers. A gulama koti, as if it is going for a wedding. Loss of appetite. It doesn't eat. Being dull, just there. And the white dropping. Assuming this is the dropping, if you see any part when it has that white color, that's a symptom of typhoid, musuja. For younger chicks under one month, it is four drops in the mouth. If they are many, Six meals to eight meals in 20 liters of water for four days. This is the administration for treatment. It shed the, the feathers being dull, not eating. With the white dropping, partly, that's a symptom of typhoid, or full typhoid. There is a difference between full typhoid and full cholera. We need to separate that. 
Typhoid, the dropping is hard, but it has a white color on it. And for cholera, it's a diorrhea, the chocolate diorrhea, and it is acute. It takes just six hours to kill all of them. Once you come across this white diorrhea, chocolate, Bobato ina dagara, emergency, they are going to die. And the cause of typhoid and fall cholera, it is due to unhygienic water, dirty, contaminated water. It is a bacteria. It kills. So that's the way how it is. Now, if it comes, it warms. Once you sense that your cheeks are like a generator, there you understand that they have developed the worms. We call them that disease gape worms. For the trachea here, it's the lung worms which causes that to be like a generator there. It is just drops for chicks under one month. The one which is one month plus, it is one meal. It is done once the following day, mix in water and give them for four days. If it is done, stop there. It's like this fall cholera here. The same treatment is that. Now we have the intestinal worms. When we talk of the intestinal worms, these are the thread worms, tape worms, hook worms, round worms. They are all intestinal. They grow thin, loss of appetite, and even stunted growth. Decrease of laying, it is due to worms. Treatment, if we were to use the chemical medicine, use albendazo, use piperazine, use riverside, use diamond, or ascaric for chemical. But make sure when you use that chemical medicine, don't eat the eggs, neither the meat, up to 21 days. If you do that, cancer is with you. I have to be very clear about that. If we are to be treating using chemical medicine, make sure your last treatment lasts for 21 days before eating what is producing. It is like in livestock. When we come back to livestock diseases, we are going to handle that. But now we are in chicken. But ours here, even if you give it now, and you see that in the evening, it is still losing sirota eat. And cook it and eat it. Because this medicine of ours is made from plants. And it does not have any harm with the human being. Because our research, we developed and we discovered that whatever is done here using this chemical, med I mean the herbal medicine, it has no side effect. People may see, mm, you can see how it is. It has no side effect with the human being. If you treat it and you see that it is not recovering and it is becoming weak, please slaughter it and eat it. You have seen, huh? meaning it has no side effect with the human being. Unlike the chemical medicine. The chemical medicine is all about treating and not eating what you have treated. I need to be very clear about that. 
because I'm not fighting against this chemical medicine. No. But once you use this chemical medicine for treatment, it should take 21 days before eating it. Because it is chemically mixed up. I need it to be very clear. Lino, once you use it, don't eat what you have treated. If it has not taken 21 days of the medicine, that's how it is. So, I always tell you that we are not fighting against the chemical medicine, but the administration is my concern. The administration and the usage is my concern. That's why I'm here. We are not gamblers. No. What we want is to see that every human being, every community is empowered to stand on your own feet and become a vet of your own farm. There is nothing I lose. Because we are in the image of the Almighty. There is a reason, this is the reason why we didn't die in 2023. We have other roles and responsibilities we have to fulfill before we are taken. People have been losing their animals. People have been losing their chicks due to ignorance. That's why we are here. So when I tell you that at times before commenting, and before complaining, at least reserve some reckless comments. My weakness, I know I don't pick calls. But if you are not tolerant to that, you look for another channel. Now, when we talk of coccidiosis, this is a cause of poor hygiene. The sign and the symptom of coccidiosis, the common is the brown dropping and the bloody droppings. It is caused by poor hygiene, contaminated water and contaminated feeds. Expect this. It can be prevented by being clean. Maximum sanitation. You will not see this. Treatment. If we were to use the chemical medicine for treating coccidiosis, it is amprolium or sulfur. If not that, use the tracycline 20 25%. It is oral. If we are not using that, come to us. We give you this. It takes three to four days when everything is done. Why? Every chemical medicine you see here is made from plants. Get it clear from me. Every chemical medicine you see here is made from plants. These ones here. But the administration is, once you use the chemical medicine in water, it, it requires, it takes only 24 hours. Body red dagger zungu no take mazi. Make sure it does not exceed 24 hours in usage. And once you open it, like those people who normally use this powdered form, once you open, now you see, I don't know. Because some people there fail to understand. But the major cause is the administration. Now, this is your circuit. If this is the circuit of amprolium, oxyveto, tetracycline, oxyvitamin, uh, amproline, 
doxin, gentamycin, tyrosine, and you cut here to remove the powdered medicine from here. Make sure you use it once. But you people, you have the, the tendency of folding and keep. This is expired. Don't use it. It comes poisonous. But people don't know. There is no manufacturer who is stupid enough not to indicate here that this circuit is used for four days. It contains 100 grams in 200 grams, knowing it's going to be mixed once. Nemu abamu mugena nemu mantara. No salako. No mala no zinga no tereka. It is totally wrong. Medically and veterinary policy and rules. Never use that one circuit and keep it in the house there. Because that oxygen there, which is the or carbon which is inside there, once it goes off, that marks the end of everything. That's living agriculture. Every manufacturer had, has a right to write here that one tablespoon in 20 liters, but they indicate clearly 100 grams in 200 liters of water. Abagwagwa never wandi kakokuno. That's wrong. These are the people who are misleading our farmers. There is no manufacturer who cannot indicate here that you use one tablespoon in 20 liters. But if it is not there, the movie cola. You are killing people's animals. And you are killing people's chicken because of that negligence. And you don't make research. Even this one here, once you start using it, it should not exceed 30 days. Lino Borisimura one. And you start using it. Because once you put it inside here, that air which comes out and you inject again oboga same way bibyo no work are done this is how it is done i remind you the uganda version book is out at 80000 We started making our own feeds at the office there. We started making our own concentrates. By the way, this is an offer for 2024. Anyone with diabetes, please, an offer treatment is free of charge. Because what we are doing is to see that what we do, we fulfill that in terms of helping our farmers. And whoever is viewing, if you have anyone with a diabetes, call Hajati's number, but make sure you come and pick it yourself. We don't deliver that medicine for diabetes. It is free of charge. Gwoboboli na yomu ntuo mwade wa sukari edagara ya abwerele from plants. And we are very ready to give those who will be ready to come and pick it at the office there. Free of charge. Diabetes, ye sukari. Hajati's number is 0779 93 00 60 if you have a problem with the diabetes, I told you before, we are researchers. The four years I stayed in the, 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 the health medical forced me to make research on the plants. 
And that's why why some people I, I, I hear them shouting. I'm a medical clinical officer. What can you do? I'm a veterinary officer. What's your research? If we cannot have people who can come out and find solutions for our community, you are wrong. I'm ready to be hated by people. But those who understand and follow me are going to benefit. The medicine for diabetes, we have it at our office, free of charge. To gain the only 100 people, even if it has taken like a four to five years, Jangu. Naebo Oboja, Jangu Nenkumi Bidi, only 2,000 for parking in this Jerichan. Jangu Nenkumi is Bidi, Oba Jangu Nenkumi Tan. You either come with the 2,000. Oh, five thousand. Abamu ba jagama. If you feel two thousand or oh, five thousand too much, don't come, because we are not going to pack them in our t-shirts or dresses. Echo change gala to manye. I thank you for viewing. I thank you for liking. For today, that's the way how we have gone. Wait for the next episode when we are going to handle the, li the, the livestock which is going to cover cattle, sheep, and goats one by one.